Hello there, good afternoon. We've seen a bright start to the week for many areas of the UK and we'll see some more of that sunshine through the rest of this afternoon. However, there is some wet weather around. The rain will just be clearing the far southeast of Kent over the next few hours. We could see the odd light shower across central areas of England, but I think most areas will stay dry and there will be some fairly long-lived sunshine. The best of the sunshine is going to be across parts of Northern Ireland, Western Scotland, as well as parts of Western Wales and the south coast of Devon and Cornwall. That's where we're more sheltered from this northeasterly breeze. So in that sunshine, it will be feeling fairly pleasant in the west. However, in the east, exposed to that breeze, it's going to be feeling much colder than the temperatures will suggest. So these are the feels like temperatures. So we'll be feeling much closer to two or three degrees across that east coast. And we will see some gusty winds still continuing through the English Channel through the rest of the afternoon. The winds will ease through this evening and that will allow a frosty night tonight for many areas, particularly across parts of Scotland through the first part of the evening. And then that frost will become a, a greater risk across parts of Wales and into southern areas of England too. We'll also see some mist and fog developing across the far southeast. So it could be a bit of a murky start for, for these areas tomorrow morning. Across the north and west, it will still feel quite cold tomorrow morning, but the frost will be limited because we'll see some wet weather arriving. This band of quite blustery rain will push eastwards through the day on Tuesday. So quite an unpleasant driving spell across the far northwest of Scotland first thing tomorrow. And that wet weather will push into southern areas of Scotland, northern England and into western areas of Wales by lunchtime or early afternoon. Behind it, though, it should brighten up to end the day across Northern Ireland and much of Scotland, but we will see some quite blustery showers pushing in from the north and west. And ahead of this band of rain across the south and east should stay dry through much of the day, but it will be a much cloudier day than today. And because we could get off to a quite a murky start, it'll probably feel quite cold through much of the day with highs of around six or seven degrees. That band of rain pushes southeastwards through Tuesday night. And behind it, we see some fine weather for the start of Wednesday before some rain Rain arrives into the northwest on Wednesday, but that will bring some milder air to end the week. See you later.